Alright guys, this is just a quick tutorial on how we can illustrate a plant in Adobe Illustrator and how we can actually animate this in After Effects. So um, let's quickly start by creating a cool plant. Let's start with the base. A cool looking circle. Select the two points at the end and make it pointy like this. Now copy it, hold alt, drag it down, and maybe rotate it a little. Copy it one more time and flip it. Copy this, copy it again, rotate it a little, That looks pretty cool, I guess. Just gonna change this a little bit. Maybe something like this. Yeah, that will do. Um, now I'm gonna expand this. Now I'm going to Pathfinder and merge it, like so. Now we can finally copy our plants to Adobe After Effects. As you can see, I've already made a composition for the background and I just got this free stock image of a website. Um, so that's our background composition. Now we're gonna create a new composition for the plant. And now create a new solid. Hit command V and there's our little plant. So the first thing we're gonna do is change the anchor point all the way to the bottom and then change the position to the bottom. And now we can change the scale. So let's set it to a hundred at one second and put it to a zero at the start. So now it grows from the base. Pretty cool. But we also want to make the top grow a little bit. So we have to play around with our masks. So select all of them and click on mask pad. And now we're just gonna select the top part like so change the position in the timeline and now hit shift up just a few times maybe three times like this should be fine and now it first starts to grow from the bottom and then the top starts to grow but this can start a little earlier I guess so let's just move this Cool. Yeah, that looks nice. So that's the plant. Save it. Go to your background. And now import the plant composition. Um, just move it around a little bit to a nice spot. And then we're gonna play around with the puppet tool. So select the puppet pin tool and we're gonna create three pins. So one at the top, one over here, and one down here. 
and now we can just play around with the position of the top one you can actually just drag it but as you can see here this is going wrong as you can see it actually cuts our artwork so we have to change the expansion drag this all the way up so now it looks a lot better and as you can see now it looks like the plant catches some wind which looks cool so I'll create another keyframe and this time drag it to the other side I think that's pretty nice actually there's one thing we can do um, let's add some sound to this so I've just imported this sound which I got from this motion sound pack which is definitely worth the money this is not endorsed by them at all but um, I just use these sounds a lot and they they are pretty nice so um, let's see what happens when we add that sounds pretty crispy I like it so this is our final animation of course you can add more sounds of course you can copy some of these plans uh, make some variations I don't know but um, yeah it's pretty simple it looks pretty cool man I'm always doing this wrong so you can just make some variations with this play around with it make a few copies pretty sweet guys so that's it i hope this video helped and i will see you guys next time bye bye